Imagine tomorrow morning you have to get to work by 8 a.m., but instead of having to pay attention and sit through traffic for 45 long minutes, you can take a nap on your way to work in the comfort of your own vehicle. This kind of technology is only adapted into everyday life once there's a lot of data to support and establish a strong foundation in the machine learning softwares to make safe and reliable decisions. With the help of machine learning, huge amounts of data can be analyzed in order to make our mundane tasks much, much easier. Hi, I'm Sarit from Edureka, and in this video, we'll give you a brief on machine learning in less than five minutes. But before we get started, make sure to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. And if you haven't already, click the bell icon to receive constant updates. We also have a lot of courses and training programs for AI and machine learning on our website. So if you are interested in it, please do go check it out. The link will be given below. In this brief, we will quickly go over what machine learning is capable of, explain various applications that we use throughout our day, Imagine a autonomous infrastructure that could make our lives a lot easier and learning the machine learning fundamentals and foundations that are built in order to build these models. So what exactly is machine learning? Machine learning is a type of artificial intelligence that allows software applications to become more accurate at predicting outcomes without being explicitly told what the output should be. Machine learning algorithms use historical data as input to predict new output values. Here we can see Atlas from Boston Dynamics doing remarkable things. It's being able to see and analyze the obstacles in front of it and jump accordingly. Here on the left, there's a log and he jumps over it so easily. And then when the platform comes, he's able to make only one foot jumps from side to side in order to get through the obstacle course. But in order to be able to make these decisions, a lot of data must be provided in order to predict the correct outcome. Similarly, there are smart devices in our homes that you can ask to do very many things, such as turn on the lights, play music, play something on the TV, or even set a timer or alarm if needed. These smart devices can be linked to many other devices, such as the fridge, the outside lights, the inside lights, the TV, the music speakers, the security system, the thermostat, and a lot more. So dependent on the need, the smart device can be linked to the fridge if more groceries are needed, or the outside security system if someone is trying to break in, or even the thermostat if the temperature is too low or too high, and a lot more many things. But to fully utilize machine learning, we have to overcome very many challenges. Mobile applications like Uber, Ola, and Lyft still do not have fully driverless capabilities. They depend on a driver to pick up the passenger from their home and drop them off accordingly. But soon, within a decade, AI and machine learning will advance technology in order to predict when you need the ride and it'll book by itself. It'll also drive the car and commute you to your destination all on its own based on your travel habits and patterns. Let's quickly go over the four main types of machine learning. There's supervised machine learning, unsupervised machine learning, semi-supervised machine learning, and reinforcement learning. Supervised machine learning uses the raw data as input and has a supervisor clean through the training dataset and has the desired outcome ready. It then uses the algorithm to process the data and get a desired outcome. In unsupervised learning, however, the raw input data is interpreted by the algorithm or the program that's used to process the data. The outcome parameters are also not defined, so it chooses its own algorithm in order to get the desired outcome. Having machine learning skills under your belt can get you a job as a machine learning engineer, a data scientist, a data engineer, or software engineer, or product manager, or even an architect. Their salaries in the US average at about 140,000 US dollar. In India, it's about 686,000 INR. So what are you waiting for? Do go check out the link in the description given below and get started on your machine learning career. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. 
Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!